everybody this is Sinclair Hill only racing will do uh, today I'm going to take a little slight left turn I'm going to come to you today I'm not talking about the great night or my preparation for my next track event come June the 9th and 10th at Thunderbolt at New Jersey Motorsport but I'm coming to you because I've been having some uh, little slight issues around my car and I don't know what's going on um, nothing major but I just want to be on the safe side so what I did I went ahead and I purchased the Garmin Dash Cam 45. This is it right here. The Garmin Dash Cam 45. Hopefully everybody can see that. So on uh, other reviews and things I've looked at, I went ahead, um, bang for the buck. I couldn't go wrong. This is one of the uh, top rated uh, dash cams for 2017. We're in 2018. It's uh, about a year and a half old. I purchased it um, for $149.99. So I believe when it first came out, it was about $229 or $239. But I got it for $149.99. And also, it comes with an auto incident uh, detection system. It comes with a G sensor, which allows you to save footage from collisions. So you can have a complete recording of the incident. It records totally in uh, 1080p. I know there's others with 4K, but 1080p would suit me just fine. It also comes with a four gigabyte CD card, but I'm gonna upgrade that to a 64 gigabyte card. It has a full HD, uh, LSD screen at two inches. Uh, it comes with a separate magnet for your windshield so you could put it up wherever you want it on the windshield. It comes with a vehicle cable that attaches to your uh, cigarette lighter. It also comes with a USB cord so you could transfer imaging from here or videos from here to your desktop or laptop comes with once you sign up a one-year manufacturer warranty a one-year labor warranty and it does have a built-in GPS system that tracks your location direction speed date and time of the incident so there's some real good features and also looking at the back of the box if you want to it has a parking cable which allows anything that gets close within a couple of feet of your car while parked in a garage or parked in a supermarket or wherever or in your in your driveway it will automatically come on and record what's going around close to your car then it also comes with let me see here a red light and speed camera detection so if you integrate that it will pick up red lights it will pick up speed cameras which is an excellent feature and also it has a Ford collision alert system as well as a lane departure alert system the Garmin camera dash 45 so I'm not going to install it on this video, I'm just going to show you some of the components of it and then I'll come back at a later date and time, probably tomorrow or the next day with uh, daylight footage and nighttime footage. Okay, so I'm going to open up the box here so you can take a look at the components within the box. So first thing what I'll do is I'm going to show you the camera. Here's a little guy. It's about two by one. Take it out here so you guys can see it. So here's a little camera. It's about one inch on the side and width is two inches. So and here's a magnet here and it comes with a, another piece that attaches the magnet to the windshield. So here's the other piece here. So you attach this to your windshield and I think it, you gotta wait for 24 hours to 
uh, get set and then you could plug this magnet piece right here up to it so what I'm going to do I'm going to put this right behind my rear view mirror in the 2017 SS Camaro then it also comes with a vehicle cable here's a vehicle cable right here you can see that vehicle cable is right there it attaches to your cigarette lighter and this guy attaches to the side of the dash cam very simple and then you also have a USB cord here that you could probably transfer snap photos and videos to your laptop as well as to your desktop so transfer those files and here's a simple instruction manual very simple you can see that and I'm going to open it up and it's very self-explanatory but this is what it gives you attachments where to put the magnet attachment at cures for 24 hours and then you put the dash cam up very simple self-explanatory then if you turn it over it will show you how to upload your videos to your phone simple instructions one two three four you're done but knowing this here you have to download the Garmin VIRB app from the Play Store because with that app that will allow you to transfer videos from the dash cam 45 to your phone you can save them to your phone and share them with your friends or even the insurance company if need be hopefully not but it's a great feature to have I love it I don't have to use my phone and put my phone on video record or my GoPro but I'm going to have my GoPro for my racing needs my phone for my racing needs and daily driving needs and a dash cam is going to be for incidents as well as certain uploads so once again I'm going to come back with a separate video with the install with a daytime shot and a nighttime video shot of the Garmin dash cam 45 uh, hopefully this was helpful for everyone with the components and I'll be back soon with the install all right to everybody friends family thank you very much if you like this please leave a comment hit the subscribe button and don't forget to share God bless, love, peace, and happiness.